Good morning, it's Rosalie with Can't Wait to Plan. How are you guys doing? Okay, so I had to go to Michael to um, return a few things from Christmas. And um, I found this particular store. Have I been there before? I have been there before, before Christmas and even after Christmas. But it seems like they got more stuff in. Um, a bunch of these are the 90% um, 90% clearance. So I'm going to show you some um, Halloween stuff and fall stuff, which are at 90%. And then I'll go to Christmas and some Valentine's. Okay. So I got this Creatology bulletin board kit, whatever that is. I guess it's for decorating bulletin board. And this was, um, okay, I, I took out the plastic thing that has the U.S. pricing on it. But I believe this was originally, um, let's see, it was like, four, it's $4.99, yeah, $4.99 list price, and now it's $0.43, cents. so it's even higher than 90% discount, and I thought it was cute because I, there was different things that I could use. This is just a border kit you can um, punch stuff out of and you know, whatever, and use it as a borders, but there's, I think it looks like 10 borders on this. This is, you know, nice size cardstock paper, not uh, not like super thick or anything like that, but not thin either. Let me see, get this back in there. Um, and then they came with a bunch of stickers and they're larger size because it's for bulletin board. And um, so let me show you the bigger one to get it out of my hand. So these, I was thinking you can, you know, do some impression on here and so on. So it, a little bit more texture on the, um, or maybe a base of a embellishment clusters. But you got three of this one. So they have different number for different, I guess for these, it's just three of these four colors for the, which is interesting, right? These doesn't look like something for Halloween. I mean, for fall Halloween, but nevertheless, I think it's so cute. So you got 12 of, I mean, three, yeah, 12 of those. Then for these, you got four of the, um, uh, what do you call these candy? There's a name for these, but anyway, and these popcorn, no popcorn, something, something corn i think um i forgot again <laughs> what they're called but some kind of candy for halloween you get four of these you get four of the hat the witch's hat and then on these do you also get four some of them do a different number so yeah you get four of this one of the candy bags and four of this one and then you get six five of the balls of the eyeball okay so that oh my gosh 43 cents right i mean i thought that was an amazing deal um i wouldn't have bought it for you know like maybe a dollar i'll buy it but it's just you know, a lot of these are kind of some of these are a little bit larger size so um not as useful and then i got this this one i loved this is eight dollars so it was like 75 cents um, and it has a bunch of the um, weekly eyes, the chenille stems, the pom-pom in these fall colors, which I don't have any, and then these feathers. So I thought it was so nice. I mean, it's, um, it's again, not something I would pay $7.99 for. But at this price, 75 cents, it's amazing. I mean, I've never really used these. I have some, but these are really nice color. These are glitter and dark green and so on. And look at these feathers. Pretty cool, right? And I really was interested, was really, oh, oopsie. Okay, sorry. Somebody took out the googly eyes. I don't have the googly eyes in here. Okay, so nevertheless, I have plenty of googly eyes, but yeah, these colors I don't have at all. So that's kind of nice. I'm sorry, my head again hit the thingy, hit the uh, camera. Okay, so that's the, the Creatology stuff. And then I got this one, which was originally $1.29, so it was $1.13. Dollar, $1.13, dollar and it's just like a witch house um thing so here's the oh it even come with the book 
the book cover and inside you open it up and it becomes a witch house i guess so let's take a look see what's in here it's i figured even if i couldn't use all of the components i can use part of it oh this is pretty cool oh my gosh see that's recycle okay so it has this whole book that you can oh man this could be like a very neat um you can create a very neat embellishment book or something and so on but it's just like the outside of the house i think kind of you go in the door here or this could be the inside too i guess and then you have different different furniture and different scenes that you created oh my gosh this is awesome I mean, this could be something I could play with even, not just not just use some of the embellishment stuff to use. So they got this whole thing with some glitter foam, some, let me remove this so I can really stick it back in. I don't have to worry about those. Got these are chip chipboard stickers. I mean, um, not stickers, just chipboard and it's double-sided. So, because it's meant to be used as a 3D, there's some... This is supposed to create something. I don't know what yet. And these, I think it's to embellish the door and things. And then these foam uh, felt, like this is a rug and curtains. Wow. And these are stars, glitter stars in black. And this to create some of the, the like some of the furniture. These are all chipboard. So you stand them up you create them and then the the dolls isn't that neat oh my gosh that's like awesome and then you get a bunch of let me stick these back in before i lose some of them the um and then you get a bunch of these these stickers so i guess you have a, a whole instruction to go with that but oh my that is so neat yeah so you get this some additional things like this is for the bookcase and so on uh -huh. that's neat right oh gosh golly that's so cool okay so that's the witch house um play kit or whatever and then <clears throat> i got I, again i got these before and i told you guys i don't know why these are so expensive this is ten dollars original price. Who would pay that? I have no idea. But it got it got some ghosties. It got some black stars. These are sprinkle mix for real baking, um, but I plan to use it for sequin mix. And then it got the witch's hat. It got some pearls. It's really pretty actually. And now I just paid. Um, uh, what was this one? It's uh, <clears throat> very nice. thirty five. No, not thirty five cents. I'm sorry. Let's see. Cheap. Okay, 90% off, so it's like 90, 90 cents okay, for that. So that's perfect. And then, make sure. Um, and I got these uh, skateboard or board with the rollers. Yeah, skateboards. And they got Halloween images on them. And this was $2.99, so it was 25 cents. And you get eight two in each color i don't know what i'm going to use it for but i thought it's just cute um i used to do i didn't use to do skateboard but i used to roller skate and these are 33.99 originally you get 24 of these really nice bags and they're um now 35 cents and it's just really nice i got the same thing in called boo and just nice tree bag i've never really had tree bags never really do anything with those but i figure maybe i will need them in the future and then i got this these really cute they were 10 bucks originally so now they're 90 or 85 cents or something and they have the um they have the initial on them but i didn't care because i figure i can embellish or change completely the cover if i wanted to these are fabric line so they're actually really nice they are uh, decent size three and a half or so by by five and a quarter and you, it's just you open it up and it has a really nice magnet uh, door closure for a container 
So you could change it up, use it to put embellishment, to send for Happy Meals or whatever, but or just a cute little gift box. And they had quite a few more. I just picked up these four. And again, I didn't care what the initial set because I can always change that. Okay. And then I got this really cute, um, this match holiday, no, not holiday spice. They were, was it uh, giving thanks or or one of the fall collection they had, there's just a canister um, and I really like, they had inside the um, the paper pad, they had all these beautiful color uh, pumpkin and this was $12.99, so it's now um, $1.25. And I just thought it's so pretty. I mean, it's like I just removed this and maybe just put pens and different um, different things in there. And then the last thing I got that was fall or Halloween related that was ninety more than ninety percent off are these awesome, beautiful uh, print. They call them uh, I don't know. They 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 call them drinks print or whatever but they're good size too it's very similar to the one to from Hobby Lobby that I just got recently with the with the Valentine muffin but it's about 12 by 12 by 16 or so 11 and a half by 16 uh, print and this one is spice apple cider so cute so these were 20 bucks so it was a dollar 75 for each this one said pecan pie. Is that so cute? Then you can put them all together even on a, on a wall or just do it separately for a, um, you know, decor table for the fall. And this one is my favorite. It's a pumpkin spice latte. Isn't that yummy? Oh, it's so nice. For a dollar something, a dollar 25. I couldn't believe it. Okay. So let me put this back here. And then Christmas-wise, I got, let me show these. I got a bunch of um, gift wrap paper, again, but stuff I don't already have. I don't, I don't have hardly any silver gift wrap paper. And um, so I picked that up. It's 70% of $5, so it's $1.20, 25. I got this one that I thought was super cute. It's just a bunch of ginger, like kind of like a gingerbread color paper. It got gingerbread house, it got the deer, Christmas tree, and so on, and the sleigh. And again, these are only, uh, this one is 30 square feet. This, the foil one is only 20 square feet for $1.25. And so, and this one I thought was super cute, 20 square feet, foil wrap. I didn't check how thin or thick the paper is, but I'm sure it's thick here. It's not super thick, but it's not as thin as the Dollar Tree one. And this foil one is the same, 20 square feet for $1.25. But I thought this is so nice because I could use this non-Christmas also for like uh, men gift wrapping. And so I got those. Um, and... I got also, I found these. I didn't see them last time I was there. $6.99, so seven bucks divided by four. It's like a dollar fifty, a dollar fifty or dollar seventy-five or so. But it came with with um, jute or whatever you call this. And um they keep putting all these things in there. I don't know what that's for. And it comes with did it say? Doesn't say, but it comes with two, four, six, twelve of these fabric line. These are fabric um, garland in the Christmas tree shape. So you get you get three of each pattern. But I just thought they're so cute. They're nice size. You can definitely cover that somehow and um, use that as embellishment, or even if you want to make a garland. I mean, that's cute as a garland as well, but beautiful, right? Awesome. Okay. And then I got these, um, I already opened these. Um, what do you call these? These foam stickers, you get 120 pieces. And these are actually quite nice. The I got the one, these are two two different colors, silver glitter and, and uh, gold glitter. 
and these are two inch stars and the one and a half inch stars and you can always use stars to embellish things on your project so i thought that was a nice um nice find and it was like a dollar a dollar 25 or something like that because it was originally five dollars and now it's 70 percent off and then i got this pack that was there was a lot more in there but it was so fat so i took some out so it doesn't show so weird um on screen but this was also 120 pieces and you get uh two four six eight sixteen different design and so whatever that divided it's like maybe eight pieces or so per design and these are the design you get i already stick them in here make it easier so you get a um uh, what you might call it a, a kind of like a little bit more like a champagne a not champagne exactly because it's not it's more rose gold instead of yellow gold so a light rose gold glitter a deeper rose gold glitter and if you move it there's a, a specks of red in there and then you get these two these guys scare me a bit it's kind of weird looking i don't like the face at all and there's a boy and a girl so you see the boy and the girl has a little bow on her head same thing here you can see it better here and these i figure you, i can actually use the peachy keen stamps that i got recently and i even got it as a um as a digital file so i can scale it down and see maybe i can stamp it on these uh foam pieces of the um gingerbread right not much better than these because these are yeah yucky and by the way those came out really badly anyway they were check them out i mean they were like all stamp all weird and lopsided you see let me see if it's focus and that way so i actually in the one i store in the thing i trimmed it so that it's not it, it's not so weird and lopsided you see they they didn't they didn't cut it very evenly so that and then you got these cute houses in the regular green and then the glitter green and so on and then these two cute one that's already you know got color and stuff so for a dollar 25 you, you really you know you can't complain too too much right and then i got let's see what's the other one that was christmasy am i losing it I think was that it was that all christmas couldn't be i guess so oh no i'm sorry and then i got this ribbon just i've seen it before but didn't pick it up and it just i don't have any gingham red uh, black gingham like that oops again and uh three bucks so it's like i don't know 75 cents or something i'm so sorry i keep hitting the thing okay and uh, so and i also saw this at the you know at when you check out that that row where a lot of things were a dollar or two dollars or whatever they had these they had one more say family but i didn't get that one it just say love home and you stand it on the table like that and they were normally a dollar they were on sale for 50 cents so i figured I, I pick it up i don't know paint it maybe paper put some pattern paper on these and you know decoupage it or whatever i just thought they're cute and i mean even if you left it like this it's not bad either um you can also stain it with your ink pads or whatever so that and now i go to valentine's okay so oh and then this one this one my daughter does a lot of dancing so this one was not super cheap it was normally four dollars on sale for two so i got it but it's you know it's not a a great sales but it's hey it's still 50 percent off and then i got these um in the the valentine's section now, i didn't even check their regular sticker section i didn't have time but this was just in the front of the store where all the valentine stuff was and i thought this was so cute it's just a puffy um hearts that got glitter in it and i love this one this one got some cute um which i'm gonna call it uh, wooden hearts with different words in it and these i got i was using my 20 percent coupon so i mean it's not a, a great deal but i just want to have it and you know if they go on sale later i and it hasn't been too long i can always return it and and buy it back so it's like four dollars for this 
Same here, and I love these. These puffy stickers are so cute. Love conversational heart. I always love the color, you know? Are they so pretty, so pastel? And then I, um, uh, what do you call it? These uh, sticker book I thought was a good deal for the same price as these. So, no, I'm sorry. These were only $3. So it was like two something. But these these were expensive. So for the same price as this, you get a whole sticker book, right? So it's $4. Um, and look how cute. These got all red foil on it. This page does not have red foil, but I love these envelopes. Is that so cute or what? I just hope it's focusing. Is it focusing? Okay. Um, these red foil hearts. This word put love. Now the book is smaller, but they scale the stickers to not be too, too small. So it's got the alphabets. Got the cute sentiment, some boxes. I hope this is focusing. It doesn't look right to me, but anyway, I have to check it. If I have to redo this, I'll be super mad. Okay, and then that got some uh, stamp canceling situation, some cute uh, hearts, some words, some tags, and there you go. You get. Um, Looks like you get like 10 sheets, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, 10 sheets of that. And then the other one that they have, this is my favorite out of the two books. Look how cute that is. And look at these beautiful watercolor balloons. Got these. Now these have gold foil on them. These stamps is so cute. The stamps in this one is cute. And then the envelope in the other one is super cute. This wreath, heart wreath. Oh, this is so sweet. And then these words, phrases. So every page is different. No repeats here. So cute, right? Oh my gosh, I love it. Love, love, love. And these tags are cuter than the other one. So that's that one, $4 on, I mean, $5 and, you know, on sale. And then I saw this in somebody's haul. I can't remember. Uh, maybe the queen, I'm not sure. But it's something you can stand on the table. And it, they had another one, a different one. But I love this one so much. All you need is love and coffee. And I just love the design. They're much better than the other one. And this was $10. So I got, I got it for 8 But so cute, right? Oh my gosh, I love it. Love, love, love. All right, and then just a couple of things I got at um, Home Goods. I had to come back and return some Valentine stuff that I got from my last haul because I um, finally finished. I finally found a spot in my craft room because I don't have any space outside. I was trying to get my husband to to uh change out the our front lo hobby i mean hobby lobby what do you call it the front entrance the front entry hall and he wouldn't do it so i can't i don't have any credenza space or anything to create a little display for each season so i went ahead and i clear out um the one of the spot right in front i mean right inside of our my craft room door and I'll show you that at the end. So if you wanted to take a look at that, stay, stay there. I'll stay here. But it's not a, it's not a huge space. And I had bought too many Valentine stuff. I mean, I kept more than what fit on there. But still, there was quite a few extra that I needed to return because, like, I got two pillows, and I, I knew I only needed one, but I just didn't know which one would work best. So anyway, I had to go back. To home with to return those so i saw these and um these are just a dollar a dollar two dollars a dollar eighty but i bought it mainly for this <laughs> i thought it's so cute i love donut uh images so um can always use more of those and then i got this one so cute this was a dollar and it just got a bunch of doggies this is a huge bag or a bunch of doggy images and so on and I just thought it's so sweet. So I got those. And then I found, um, not that I was looking. Actually, I was looking. 
because I didn't get one um, last time. Not that I need another throw because I have one already, uh, several actually, but this is, I just couldn't help myself. This was $17 and look at all these images, guys. You know how much I love dogs and look at these guys in booty, <laughs> red booty, heart sunglasses, you got all different breed of dogs. Look at this one right here. Oh my gosh. And it's in that soft pink. And it's so pretty. So cute. Look at this one. Say, be mine. And you have this chihuahua, whatever he is. I mean, they're just so sweet. So I just love it. I can't wait to play with it. Every time I pull out one of the new, pretty, you know, soft blankie, I end up giving it to the dogs because they love to lay on them so my my tootsie and sushi get to enjoy them and i don't get to enjoy them at all okay and then the last thing i got was i had to go oh and what did i find okay so i had to go to um to uh back to um the tj maxx which is also home good so i went to the same place but this is the one that no no you know what no i'm sorry that this is part of home goods too i found this one isn't this so cute it's just a jar and again oh, what was in there i don't need all these canisters but it's so cute and it's the the one of the first few actually there were a few more things in there gnome but this look at it they're decorating the eggs i just thought it's so cute it was seven dollars which i thought was a reasonable product reasonable price a good price so i picked that up and then i had to swing by the uh, burlington to exchange something for my daughter because it didn't fit and i saw this was it was three dollars but it was kind of you know i mean basically it's not so this is a three dimensional balloons which you can always use this was pretty but i bought it mainly for this <laughs> And I love, love, love the design so much. I'm going to cut it out to use it as pattern paper. But I just thought it's so pretty. And I mean, not that I need any more paper. I have so many. But I just love that. So I won't cut it out for a while in case I need a big bag. I can always use that. But I don't think I will be able to use this as a gift bag. I, def I will keep it for myself. And I think, oh, and then I had to go to Walmart to pick up my photos. And on the way there, I found this, which was like a dollar. They didn't have anything. They didn't have my, that Walmart didn't have any Valentine's stuff, didn't have anything. But this was just, actually it was just laying around somewhere. It was not even in the right section. But these are Puffy's Mermaid. And you know how I love my mermaids. And so I picked that up. Okay, so that's all the kind of miscellaneous haul I did, but let me show you now uh, my decorating area. Now you can see my walls. I'm not gonna show you the room because it's still so messy. So this is my, isn't that so cute? Oh, actually, I don't know if you can see it because it's gonna be so dark. Um, and then my TV, and here is my area that I created. So it's on top, right on top of this. So I still have a bunch of paper down here. That's my paper bin. Um, I, it's only half filled. But on top here, there was a, a whole unit up there that held a bunch of um, two sections of 12 by 12 paper bin. So I took those away and I was going to do something else with it. But this is what I did. So I got the, you see the Hobby Lobby one? The Hobby Lobby um, prints here, and um, that I just got recently. That one up there. Let me see if I need to get a. That one up there is from um, Dollar Tree. The gnome felt piece right here. That's from um, ninety nine cent store. Sorry, it's a little dark, so I don't have enough. Oh, you know what? Let me see if I can pull this light over. It may be too shiny. Is that, is that a little bit better? Yeah, whatever. Um, and then I got this, um, this love, this pillow, the gnome pillow that's from Home Goods. 
this soulmate one that's from home good that's a little drink drink uh, cup with a lid that's hobby lobby gnome that's a um from uh, dollar tree these two little candle stand that's in pink the two red stand candle stand that's here and i put one um on this side somewhere is over here underneath that little planter is from um 99 cent store that i got at 50 percent off so it was only like a dollar each instead of two dollars i got this from i believe that's from let me see i think that's home good i'm not sure let's see i left all the price and everything in yeah that's from home goods um so that way i i can tell you guys where i got stuff from um, that love sign was like $8 from uh, Burlington. You recognize these two, you know, uh, what do you call these rolling pins from Hobby Lobby. These pink rose flowers. I got one here and one there. I love them. I got them um, at a clearance from Michael's for $0.25 cents for, for a set of two. Um, I got the little truck from... Where was that from? I think it's Hobby Lobby. Yeah, it was $8. So I did got it for 40% off. And these flowers, oops, now you can see better. These flowers I got from Ali AliExpress at one time. So I just stuck them in. I just, I didn't even glue anything down because I just put in some um, glass beads or whatever so that they, they can rest on top. And um, these, this is of course, you recognize the Hobby Lobby uh, bubble gum machine. And um, these were from not either 99 cent store or the, or the Dollar Tree, I don't remember. This lovely stand right here, I love it. I think it's, it works better for me than the, the round three tier one. And because of the space I have, and that's from uh, Target, a dollar spot for $5. And these, I bought a set, I think I showed to you, for $3 for a set of three. And that's the three, the the uh, mushroom. And the last mushroom I didn't use, I didn't fit there. I put it in here. And these hearts, that's from um, Dollar Tree or 99 cent store, I can't remember. But I use them um, to to decorate this little planter spot that I got for a dollar twenty-five at a fifty percent half off at ninety-nine cent store, and actually I left all of the all of the greenery in there because I really didn't think I need to remove any. I just took the the hearts uh, stems that I got from Dollar Tree or whatever, and I cut them up and I just stick them in. I just thought that was make it so Valentiney, and it's still it's still winter, so it's okay. You can you see the snack cup I got there. I just use it as stand right now, but I didn't want to introduce any other colors just to hold up the pillow. I actually kept this pillow because of the shape, but also because it's not as stuffy as the other one. The other one was they put in so much filling that it just looks weird. Um, I had a really cute. Um, it's like a. Uh, a, a container I got from I can't remember where I got it from but it's really cute it got like purses in the shape of a purse um, and then these flowers you recognize it's from Dollar Tree and I was gonna I actually had it out because I was gonna use it in here but the you can see that the pink didn't match this pink this pink has a little bit of coral in it so it matched these flowers better so instead of putting it away i just stuck it on here it kind of matched that pink better and then that cup is that glass is from dollar tree i just stuck in a bunch of glass beads that are uh, holographic clear as well as pink and i just stuck the leftover glitter hearts from dollar tree or whatever that toads mushroom and that's just a handmade paper that i was doing at a at a craft show and i think that was everything isn't that so cute i love it this is the first time i have anything because usually you know we don't have a space outside but that's my little and then that's my door right here you to come into my craft room so 
that's just perfect it's the first thing i will see and it makes me happy so in any case you guys have a great time i will talk to you real real soon i have a really nice um uh, haul that i just that just came in so i'm gonna uh, pop that on for you tomorrow from the crafty retreat they are having an amazing sale so if you want to go ahead and check that out it's thecraftyretreat.com but in any case i will show you more tomorrow of everything i got all right i'll see you real soon bye for now